Frankly in Love by David Yoon. Frank Lee is Korean-American and lives in two different worlds. In one world, he's a semi-geeky, nah, really geeky, American teenager with a crush on a white girl named Brit. At home, though, he's the son of two Korean immigrants who run a convenience store, and Frank knows that his super Korean parents will never permit him to date anyone other than a Korean girl. Also, they only prefer he hang out with other Korean teens, and that he absolutely must get a near-perfect score on his SATs so that he can get into his parents' choice of college, the Harvard. It's a lot of pressure, and if he wavers from any of those parental expectations, he's sure that his parents are going to disown him, much like they disowned his older sister, who married a black man. Then, Frank comes up with an idea. He and Joy, who is a Korean girl his family knows, uh, they can pretend to date each other, their parents would be thrilled, but when they actually go out together, they hang out, they split up, they hang out with the American, meaning not Korean, friends that they really want to see. There are some really laugh out loud moments as well as some poignant family, very tender moments that provide a peek into a culture that well, folks like me don't get to see. It's a coming-of-age story where the main characters not only face their own future, but also their family's cultural past. Frankly in Love is author David Yoon's first novel, but you might recognize his name. His wife, Nicole Yoon, has published two incredibly successful YA novels, Everything, Everything, and The Sun is also a star. If you read or saw either of those movies, I have no doubt you'll like the romantic coming-of-age novel by David Yoon, frankly in love.